Hi, my name is Eyal Markovic, Director of Performance and Caminario. I would like to share with you today my uh, methodology and method for monitoring and ident identifying storage bottleneck within database application. Storage is still the number one uh, performance problem or the root cause for a storage uh, for a database performance. And uh, it's not a surprise when you think of how many sites that are still keeping their most valuable uh, production data within a mechanical disk. But even that, even that storage is still such a major uh, problem, I still see DBA and storage admin struggling answering questions such as, is my storage a bottleneck? Will replacing my storage give me the expected improvement in, data, in my database application performance? Part of the reason why DBA or storage admin struggling with the answering this question is because they're looking at storage with storage metrics, with metrics such as latency, throughput, and IOPS, which are looking on uh, the storage activity and not on uh, storage activity for a specific application. And this is the first takeaway from, uh, from this, is when you think about storage for an application, you need to look on the storage from the application, application point of view. And I do that using what I uh, call IO wait time, which I calculate for each database application. So what's an IO wait time? Let's think of a uh, a process, a job that takes uh, for one, uh, one, I mean, one hour uh, duration. Here's, a, here's something that uh, started at uh, 8 and completed at 9, and that can be a job or a task or end user activity, and it took one, uh, one uh, hour to, com uh, to complete. The first thing that I do is I want to take this uh, job and break it into two uh, measurements. The first measurement is work time, and the second is uh, wait. Work time will be the duration or the percentage of time that this database was actively using the CPU, executing uh, things on behalf of my activity. Wait, on the other end, will be the time or the percentage of time that the database waited, or the session of the database waited for resource. Now, the weights themselves, I break it into different categories, different events, uh, uh, such as network, memory, as well as storage-related uh, events. Once I have the storage-related uh, weights, again, duration or percentage, I got the IO weight uh, uh, measurement. So an IO weight measurement is the percentage of time the application waited for my storage. A bottleneck in my storage is a case where the IO wait time is large. If we see a 5% uh, IO wait, it's not a storage bottleneck. If, on the other hand, we see a 70% uh, IO wait, it's a big storage bottleneck, and it has nothing to do with the latency with the IOPS or with the throughput. Now, with Oracle and SQL, I use different, uh, different tools to calculate the IO wait. With Oracle, I use the AWR report, uh, which uh, give me uh, fairly easy, give me all the information that I need to calculate the IO weight. And in this case, you can see uh, it's a case where more than 85% of the time that the Oracle was waited for the storage, so it's a, a, a storage bottleneck. In SQL Server, I use different uh, tools. I actually create. A, I actually run a script to collect the information directly from a, from several DMVs. But the end result is similar. In the end, I have a, a measurement of the all the events that are related to the storage. And in this case, you can see more than 70% of uh, of the time the database waited for the storage. Again, a storage. Uh, Balnik. In Caminario, we offer a complimentary service to do the performance analysis uh, for you. Uh, it's very simple. All you have to do is go to iostorm.com, our performance log, and select the, the performance analysis uh, link. In Oracle, 
once you've completed your once you fill up the form you will email us the AWR report while in a SQL once you complete your form you're going to get from me a script to run against your production to collect all the metrics that I need to uh, to complete the report and you then submit uh, the output of the script which I can use to create uh, the report. In both SQL and Oracle, once uh, you submitted your database, uh, we, I, I will create a report for you that will show you whether uh, you have a storage bottleneck, what's the I.O. weight uh, measurement for your database, and most importantly, what to expect from replacing your uh, existing storage in terms of improvement of your application. Thank you very much for joining me today and I look forward to receiving your performance data.